Well, hey everybody, welcome back to another thrifting video. It's Sunday and we're gonna go to a few Goodwills and see if we can find anything good to flip online on eBay for a profit. So if you're into that kind of stuff, stick around. All right, well the first thing that I'm, I found in the shoes when I, when I came in is these pair of Skechers Shape Ups. Now these things are in really good shape but they're manufactured in like 2009 and I've sold like two pairs of these and I've had to refund the buyer both times because they they fall apart they're so old the rubber just the cracks in it so but even though they look really good I'm not gonna I'm not gonna risk it on these I'm kind of done with the with the shape ups All right so we're looking through here and not really seeing much but I did come across this bike which I'm not gonna pick it up but I think it's worth mentioning it's a Sevia, Sibelia, something. I think it's a Lowry. It's a Lowry is what it has on the side. It looks like it's a pretty nice bike, but I don't think I'm going to pick it up. I don't really see any sold counts on eBay for it. And uh, I don't want to pick up something this big if I know I can't get rid of it really quickly. I would call a local bike shop and see if maybe they'd be interested in it before I purchased it. Um, but none of them are open today on Sunday. So I'm just going to leave it here. It's it's $25 anyway, so it's not super cheap, but I don't know. Maybe I'm missing out on something big. Let me know in the comments. So found a pair of Hoka's here. I'm probably gonna pick these up. They're $6.99. I'm gonna check the comps on them to make sure. They look good. Um, I do believe I'm gonna pick these up probably, most likely, I think. Maybe, sort of, I don't know. Hey, you there. You, you unsubscribed person that's probably watching this video. If you're enjoying the video, enjoying the content, hit the subscribe button. It's completely free and I would super duper appreciate it. Thank you so much. Hit the like button as well. Um, and then here we go. We're gonna get back to thrifting. All right, so we're about to jet out of this Goodwill, which is kind of busy. It's kind of a busy place, busy place right now, but we are, I'm gonna pick this up. It's only 479 Reds, I believe. It's a Nike genuine merchandise. Um, button button up kind of baseball jersey thing so it's it's in pretty good shape overall so i think we're going to go ahead and pick this up i'm not sure what the comps are but we're going to head to the next goodwill we're going to get out of here and we're going to hit at least two more i hope oh, yeah, um, so and we also found this uh kate actually found this rei jacket it's it looks like a rain jacket maybe a waterproof jacket i'm gonna try to look up some comps on it see if it's worth it it's 6.99 it's a women's medium so we're gonna we'll look it up and see if it's worth it or not. On to the next one. Goodwill number two. You have a really good vision. You have a really good vision? Joey found some pots and pans. What's this one? He found some pots and pans. Famous chef. I don't know. It's 99 cents. All right, so we're looking through this, the kitchen stuff. There's quite a bit of pots and pans here, and we're, we're kind of looking through it. And I come across these. They want $3.99 a piece, and there's three of them. Kind of like an industrial stainless steel um, restaurant buffet pot, like a soup pot. Um, there's not a lot of sold, but I figure with three of these, I could do a multi quantity listing on them since they're all identical and they're four dollars a piece and i feel like i should be able to get 25 or something maybe per pot because the the sold ones that are i'm sorry the listed ones that are unsold are really really high so i'm figuring maybe it'd be worth it just to buy them and do a multi-quantity listing of 25 dollars with, with uh plus shipping and see how it goes i think it'd be worth it worth the chance on them what do you think casey good yeah good so i would normally pick something like this up this is a ti86 calculator not a super expensive model or anything but if you but if you open it up it not only can i not test it but it, the corrosion is really bad so it's gonna pass on it they want three bucks for it and it's i don't know if, it, if, if it'll for sure work and it's only worth about 15 dollars so i'm gonna pass on it
So I found found these. These were in a cart they were bringing out. But it's some salt and pepper shakers that are copper and brass. But man, they are kind of beat up and they don't have the bottoms to them. And they want two four ninety nine each. So be four bucks for both of them. I don't know. I think I'm gonna pass. Old comps are kind of all over the place on stuff like this, and they just have like a kind of like a heart on the side of them. So. I don't know. I think I'm going to pass just because there's not a lot of them sold and just kind of all over the place. But they are cool. I'm not going to get, I'm not going to get those other things. All right. So we got this, looks like a Lacoste size, large zip up hoodie type thing. I think it's $4.89 for this. So I think we're going to pick this up. Pretty decent, pretty decent little pickup here. Nice. You got the stripes on the side. In good shape. So uh, the comps on this are looking like $25.30. We're gonna keep moving around here and probably get to the next store. All right, well, we've arrived at the last Goodwill of the day. Hopefully we find some, some good stuff, right? Yep. Fingers crossed? Yeah. Yeah, let's go see what the deals. Hopefully they got some deals in this Goodwill, right? Yep. Super deals. Yep. Yeah? Yep. All right, so we just got in this one. I'm looking at the shoes, and Kate already found a, an Ariat shirt. It's kind of like a little half half button up with some cactuses on there very western western e style 479 for that we'll probably pick it up pretty good shape and then also i just saw these i've never actually seen this brand before but it's called cvs cvs yeah um there's like a suede like leather they're a little bit torn up though so i don't know if i'm going to pick them up or not but they they do resell well it looks like but uh, I'm gonna look at look at them a little bit more and see if they're worth picking up. Probably gonna go ahead and pick these up. These are some uh, New Balance ROAV. I've never seen these before, but they look like they resell well. There's like five listed, three sold, so they're selling pretty pretty good for a pair of shoes. And uh, they look like they're in pretty good shape. So I'm gonna pick these up. They should be $6.99. $6.99. So these are. I'm gonna go ahead and pick them up. And I'm not gonna pick up this pair of freebies, even though they looked like they would sell good. They were just torn in the, in the inside soles, so left them behind. I'm gonna keep looking at these shoes, see if we can find anything else. Um, so looking at the shoes, too bad these Olakai's right here aren't in better shape. I'd probably pick them up. But I got these penguin boots here. I've actually never found a pair of penguin boots. Um, there's a little guy, a little penguin right there. They're in pretty good shape. I think I'm gonna pick them up. Should be $6.99. And I'm still trying to decide if I'm gonna pick these up. I've never actually picked a pair of these up, but they're like Nike Roll Tides or whatever. They're in okay shape. They're a little bit bald on the on the front there, but uh, I don't know. I might put them back. I'm tired of picking up shoes that are too worn or too dirty, so I might just go ahead and put these back and uh, not have to mess with them, not have to clean them or worry about them being too worn. So, we'll go look at the hard goods before we get out of here. They're closing in a couple minutes. All right, guys, well, we're back in the garage and we are gonna go over some of the things we got here. Uh, not a, not the greatest haul, uh, not the greatest haul today, but it was nice to get out and go to some Goodwills. Uh, I've got, got this Ariat shirt, which you've seen that. It's got the cactuses on it. It's very nice, very nice. Got this uh, pair of Hoka's. I'm not sure what they'll go for, but I'll have to put a comp up. Uh, these uh, these penguin now this is these might be the best find, but I did not notice initially that I paid ten dollars for them, paid ten bucks for the pair of penguin boots, which I've never actually found. I've heard of this brand before, but I've never found a pair. So it's nice to find a pair, uh, but I wish I would have paid six ninety nine like all the other shoes. That would have been great, but is what it is. Those are fancy, quite nice. We got these right here, these new balances. These are, these are comping pretty well. And uh, I don't think I've ever really picked up a Lacoste anything. I see them every now and then, but I just, I don't know. I always a little bit wary about counterfeits or fakes, but this one right here seemed pretty good. Uh, it's a hoodie, zip up hoodie. It's got the little hit right there. It's got the stripes on the shoulder. Um, I'm probably gonna wash it and list it. And these right here, when I first, when I first saw these pots, I, I knew immediately where they were because I've, I've worked in the restaurant industry before. So I knew they were like a buffet, like soup pot type thing. Um, and normally anything commercial, commercially graded kitchenware and stuff is gonna be pretty expensive or valuable. So I, I they're not as valuable as I wanted them to be, but I mean, $3.99 for each one of these pots, three of them, 
Um, they're all in pretty good condition. There's not too many bumps or dents or anything in them. Uh, I'm hoping, I don't know, let me know in the comments. I'm thinking about maybe listing it a quantity of three, like maybe $29.99 with free shipping. Uh, or maybe just list all three together since they all do slide together kind of nicely Like it really wouldn't be a big deal to ship them all together since they kind of like fit together. Well, so I don't, I don't know maybe $89.99 for all of them free shipping or or, or maybe $29.99 for I don't know. What do you think? Let me let me know what you think in the comments uh, I think there's more likely a chance of somebody wanting one than there is three but I Don't know. Let me know in the comments what you think all right, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I really appreciate you guys sticking around to watch the whole thing. Don't forget to subscribe. See you on the next one.